Hello and welcome to my channel. This is my first tutorial with voice explanation. I know it is a TTS voice but it's made specifically to explain and it's very clear and easy to understand, and that's the point of a tutorial. I will show you how to design a professional negative space logo, using Adobe Illustrator. By the end of the video you will make something like this. Like you saw in the preview, our logo gone to be a heart icon, with a drop as negative space. So, we will start by making the heart shape. First step, select the rectangle tool. Maintain shift, then click and drag to make a perfect square. Now, select the ellipse tool. Maintain Alt and Shift, then click in the center of the square and drag until you get a circle in the same size of the square. Maintain Alt, and drag the circle to the top half of the square. Now, maintain Shift and drag the circle to the right half of the square. Select everything. Go to the Rotate tool. Maintain Shift and Rotate by 45 degrees. Select everything. Now, go to the Pathfinder. And click on the Unite icon. Congratulation! You created your heart shape. Please, don't forget to ask me anything in the comment section. Let's move to the drop shape. Select the ellipse tool and make a circle. Go to the direct selection tool. Select the top anchor point of the circle, then click and drag it to the top. Select the Anchor Point tool. And then rotate the right handle to the bottom, so it becomes vertical. And drag it down a little. Drag the handle of the circle's right anchor point a bit to the top. Now, select the scissors tool. Click on the top anchor point of the shape, then click on the bottom anchor point to split the shape. Now select the left half of the shape and press delete. Now, we got the half of the drop shape. Select it. And then go to edit and click on copy. Then return to edit, and click on, paste in place. Go to object, transform, and then click on reflect. Select the vertical reflect option and press ok. Now we have the left half of the drop. Drag it to the left to complete the shape. Select the two parts. Go to the Pathfinder window and click on Unite. Congratulation! You created your drop shape. Select the two shapes. Go to the Align window then choose the Horizontal Align Center option. Reduce the drop shape until you find the perfect size. Select the two overlapped shapes. Go to the Pathfinder, and then click on Subtract.
choose the direct selection tool. Select the anchor points of the intersection of the heart and the drop. Two little white circles will appear, we call them live corners widget. Click on one of them and drag it to smoothen the heart gap. Now, we finished designing our heart drop logo, let's pick a color. I have this two colors, I picked them already. You can apply any color you want. It looks perfect. Now, let's name our logo. I am gonna name it Love Drop. You can name it what you want. Dripping Love for example. I'm gonna play around a little with the type. You can download the logo source file from the description. It's a gift for you. This is our final logo, thank you for watching. If you liked the video push that like button, and don't forget to subscribe. I will upload twice a week, so stay tuned.